Hey guys, Professor Bell, Comic Book University, and Hal Jordan, the Green Lantern Corps, issue number 39. So, um, everybody's trying to figure out what is up with Kyle. He's spouting all these ridiculously stupid, fake, made-up fighter pilot sayings and whatnot. Like, he's got too much Hal Jordan in him. Meanwhile, like, he's got a, a, a pierced liver, two broken ribs, a whole bunch of damage all over the place. And he's still like, yeah, rare and ready to go. No, dude, dude needs to heal crying out loud. That's the thing. He thinks he's more powerful. The trick is he's not necessarily more powerful. He's just using Hal's power. So Hal was beaten. So it's one of those things where it's like, you're not going to win. You're, you're not going to win, dude. And, um, what do you call it? Seven more of the Lantern Corps decided to go after him, totally against orders, which what else should be expected? Led by hothead Guy Gardner. Oh yeah, this is going to end really well. So John Stewart goes to try and have a conversation with, and this is probably the best part of this, tries to have a conversation with the Guardians, and they're just like, huh, well, let's think about it. Come back later, and we'll, we'll give you the answer. So he's like, uh, dude, what are you talking about? You usually give us the order right away. He's like, yes, but that is the problem that we've always had. So we're going to blow up the Earth. Yeah, you were wondering where that voice was from, right? So <laughs> I had to think about it myself anyway. So, um... Uh, what do you call it? It's like, I liked it better in the past when you guys just acted instinctively. But like, yeah, that always led to the wrong kind of answers. So we're going to think this one out really quick. So while they were thinking out, the guys went. And of course, uh, Stuart is just like, it's about time you guys, you know, finally, have, you know, went on your own, <laughs> completely disobeyed orders. So, yeah. Uh, this was interesting and all that. They're, I don't know exactly why they're trying to hold on to the lantern ring. Because obviously this is important. They're up to 90% of uh, having downloaded all of its information. I don't know what they need the information for. Maybe something to do with Krypton itself. They're going to try and build a new Krypton. I don't know. I don't know. Either way, this is interesting. I can't wait to see what's going on. Also, next issue, they're promising a fight between the Zod family, minus the Eradicator. He's still working on the ring, versus these eight lanterns. I'm looking forward to the beatings. I'm looking forward to it. Anyway, guys, Professor Bell, Comic Book University. Class dismissed.